friends welcome to our youtube channel electronics for you friends in this video i will explain how to solve an example using thevenis theorem so this is the example where the circuit consisting of uh, inductors resistors and capacitors so this is a, a problem of uh, an ac network so you can see here that there are some reactances and some resistances so we can convert it into impedance or we can directly solve the problem uh, generally thevenis problem can be solved by uh, solved in three steps the first step is calculation of vth then second step will be the calculation of zth and the last is to draw the thevenin's equivalent network and we have to draw the thevenin's equivalent network for this circuit it is in between terminal a and b now let us solve the example our step 1 will be calculation of vth so vth is nothing but thevenin's equivalent voltage source so we have to convert this circuit into a circuit where we can calculate vth the condition for calculation of vth is to remove the load resistance now the load resistance is not given in this case the load resistance is not given in this case it is a simple example which is uh, we have to where we have to obtain the thevenin's equivalent network between this terminal so what we have to do we have to just calculate the vth in between these two terminals so this is your terminal a and let this terminal be b and the voltage between this terminal is vth to calculate voltage between this terminal we have to assume the current flowing through this terminal is i let the current flowing be i now we can apply any theorem which uh, where we can calculate this i so you can apply kvl you can apply uh, mesh analysis or uh, if the current source is given you can apply nodal analysis and so on whichever the theorem which uh, the theorem where we can calculate the current i we can use it so in this case i will i will use simple formula to calculate the current i that is uh, we will apply mesh analysis here or we can apply kvl okay so i will write here applying kvl here the current let us change the direction of current as uh, this is positive sign and uh, let the current flow in this direction so applying kvl here uh, this is the 2 ohm resistance then uh, this is j6 ohm and this is j4 ohm so it is 2 plus j6 times i this is the first potential drop then second potential drop will be here and it is minus j4 multiplied by i now this is potential drop equal to voltage sum of potential drops is equal to sum of emf so the emf will be pi angle 90 degree now therefore i will be equal to that is current we can have this i common here this is pi angle 90 degree over this is 2 plus j2 so after solving this we will get it as 1.25 plus 
प्लस वन पॉइंट टू फाइव जे और जे वन पॉइंट टू फाइव यू कैन राइट इफ यू विश टू कन्वर्ट इट इन टू पोलर फॉर्म यू कैन कन्वर्ट इट इट विल बिकम and the unit for this is uh, ampere now we have to find vth so the equation for vth will be therefore vth this is the vth which is which can be obtained here uh, so let us moving uh, let us move from this direction to this direction and apply kvl again we have to apply kvl that is uh, this one so if we move from this point now let us decide the direction the current entering through this capacitor is plus here and this is the minus sign now vth will be equals to this is sum of voltages is equals to sum of potential drop so voltage is nothing but vth and it is equals to this one second sign through this path is negative so minus times minus j4 now the current flowing is i similarly this one this one is the positive positive phi angle 90 degree so plus phi angle 90 degree will be here and the last one is this one that is second sign in this path is negative that is or you can consider that it is the voltage is dropping from positive to negative as the voltage is falling we can have it as negative so minus 10 angle 0 degree again if we solve it we will get answer as minus 15 so put the values uh, value of i here you can put any value uh, it is uh, 1.25 Plus one point two five j. After solving this, you will get it as minus fifteen plus ten j. Or convert it into polar form, you will get it as eighteen point zero three angle one forty six point three one old. So this is the voltage that we have to find it is your vth highlight it because it is very very important now our step 2 is to calculate zth that is thevenin's equivalent impedance and to calculate zth what we have to do we have to remove load resistance now no, no load resistance is given here and therefore zth will be obtained in this point now we have to also remove the uh, voltage sources and current sources so remove the current sources or voltage sources now no current source is given here only voltage sources are given so voltage source is to be replaced by short circuit and current source is to be replaced by open circuit so voltage source let us remove it and replace it with short circuit so i am replacing it with short circuit and also removing this voltage source with a short circuit if any current source is given we have to replace it with open circuit so so uh, our circuit will be modified like this this is our step 2 to calculate zth now from this diagram you can calculate zth that is uh, this 4 ohm resistance is in series with the parallel combination of these two resistances uh, these two impedances so zth will be equals to 4 plus as it is in series with parallel combination of these two now parallel combination of these two is nothing but multiplication in numerator that is 2 plus j6 multiplied by minus j4 divided by addition in denominator that is 2 plus j6 plus minus j4 so after solving this you will get it as 8 minus 8j again you can convert it into polar form and polar conversion will become 
11.31 angle minus 45 degree unit for this is ohm as this is an impedance so this is our step 2 now step 3 is to draw Thevenin's equivalent network so Thevenin's equivalent network will be Now let us draw the Thevenin's equivalent network here uh, where we have to just put one voltage source in series with ZDH here it will be ZDH and here it should be load but as no load is given here let it be terminal A and B so it is your terminal A and B uh, it is your VTH the value for VTH was 18.03 angle 146 degree so just write it as 18.03 angle 146.31 unit for this is old and uh, ZTH that uh, we have just calculated it and it is 11.31 angle minus 45 degree its unit is ohm so this is your Thevenin's equivalent network thank you